Hello and welcome to Free Loan Speaker Plan website. This is the video tutorial automation level 2. So you complete your optimizations and you want to improve your automation level with Horn Resp. The next step is to use macro files. So when you download the model from the website and as we talked previously, inside the zip file you find three different macros. So what you need to do? The first thing is inside the free card you have this button here called macros. You can open it. While open it, it will give you the default path for the folders where the macros will be run you can set up a specific folder if you want to or you can use the default folder from the software so i already have a shortcut for that folder so what i will do is i will move or copy those macros to the folder where the macros should be so when i click here and open now you can see that we have three different macros the automation level 2 you will use the macro that has the indication the name of the model the horn rasp dot free card macro it's this file here the file that has the indication no dialogue and the sketch will be used in a different automation level so you can click in this one and click edit mode or execute i prefer to edit that's it so you can see what is inside the macro I think this is important for you to avoid issues like some malicious code from other websites and so on. So whenever this macro is opened, you can click here and execute the macro. So let's do it. A pop-up screen will open with a dialog to save the text file. I will save this text file in my desktop to make it easy for me to get the file. So I will call this test2.txt. Okay, you will see this messenger registration exporting file saved. So everything is done. I will minimize the screen and you can see here the text2.txt. I will copy this file to the raw and rasp input. So I already built here a shortcut for the raw and rasp input folder. I'm copying the txt there. So I will go here to the raw and rasp. I will create a new simulation I will call it test2 and then I will click on file import import horn resp record and as you can see the text2.txt is in the right folder so it will be shown here you can click on it open and as you can see your model was imported to Horn Resp and you can click on calculate it. You can click on tools, options, acoustic power and now for the next simulation it will be shown by default. Here is your result. So it's straightforward, it's very easy and it's very fast and compare it to the level 1 it avoid mistakes. So I would encourage you 
to use at least the level one if you know what you are doing maybe you prefer the level one that it's okay too but i think the level two offer you a very good balance in terms of error proofing and speed so that's it thank you